All right, this is just a review on how to use the Cami. Some of you already know, but we do have some new students who have joined us, so I'll make sure we all understand this. So first of all, you come over here to this um, little paintbrush looking, and you click on it. Let's start with this number here. This is how thick the brush would be. Like if you're painting and you ask me for a small brush, I'd give you like a, a number two. If you want like a big brush to cover a lot of, of background, I would give you something bigger. So that shows you the size of the brush stroke. So if you have something really small, you're going to want to do something small in here. Okay, so that's what that is. Down here, you're going to see the different paints. Well, on the palette, you can only have nine colors. However, if you click on this little paint palette, it will open up all the different colors you can use. So these are the nine that's on your paint palette now. And let's say, well, I don't really want both these greens. Maybe I'll pick a, a, an orange. You would click that. You have to save it. So I get rid of that green. Click on the orange. And now you see the green change to orange. And you have to save it. Don't forget to save it. And then come over to your um, thing. And there's your orange. All right. But whatever color has the red line around it, that's the color that is on your brush. All right, so right now is this light blue color. If you want it to be the orange, then that's what will happen. All right, so with that being said, let's look what the assignment is. The assignment is looking at this painting done by Alexander Calder, um, Homage to the Sun. And I need you to try the very best you can to copy the same colors that the artist chose to use in this. Because you have a lot in the sky here, you might want to use a brush that's a little bit bigger than smaller. So I come over here, and it's a size 6 now, which is about in the middle of it all. I'd probably use that one because I'm kind of comfortable with that. I would click on the orange, if that's where I want to start. And I would come up, and I would start, start using my colors. As you can see, it's going to take a, a minute um, to finish this all up. So if you'd rather change it up to a bigger brush, you can stop, come over and say, you know, that's going to take me a little while. I think I'll go to a 10 and then keep coloring it in. All right. So that's how that works. So once you get that one colored in and you want to change your color, you'd come back over here and say, well, let's say I think I'll, I have a blue here. So I think I'll go ahead and use the blue. I'll click on it. You see that's around there. Now, if I come up here and use this blue, that's not where it belongs, right? Look down here, it's supposed to be yellow. So you just come over here, here's your eraser, and just click on it and get rid of it. Now this time, go over to your paint palette and pick up the right color. And I do have a yellow on my paint palette, so I don't have to change that. So I'll just click on it, make sure there's a red line around it, and now I can come up here and color in my yellow. But while I have my yellow on here, I'm going to go through and find all the yellow that I need to put on there why I'm here. So this one here would have yellow on it. I would fill that one in. You get the idea, right? And then I come over here. This one has yellow on it. So I would go through and use all my colors. It would be quicker and easier doing that way than keep going back and forth. But you do it however you're comfortable with. That's just would be my approach. All right. Like I said, if you make a mistake, just use your eraser and click off of it. So this is how you use the cami. The cami, um, if you need to um, click on it for any reason, it's up at the top search bar and it's a, a white K and a little yellow, I mean, it's a white K and a little blue um, circle. All right. Have any questions? All my contact information is under resources under um, in Google Classroom.